tough out there today, Kevin, but perhaps it come the end of the season, a really important away point. I think we've got to be pleased with the point at, at the end of the day. I think it's a fair result. Both teams have tried the hardest in, in difficult conditions. Um, and strangely, it was probably easier to play in the wind and certainly the stats would would indicate that um, you know I think both sides had more shots into the wind than they did with it. So um, you'd think it'd be easier with the, with the wind to your back, but um, yeah, that's it. you know that's how it pans out. But uh, yeah, you know it's not a it's not a bad point at the end of the day. A critical moment at the end of the first half with the referee awarding that penalty. Yeah, I think he's the refs had lots of challenging decisions to make and. I don't think a great deal went for us, if I'm being honest. But like I say, I don't want to start criticising referees and making referees the reasons why we you know, we haven't won a game. But I certainly feel there were one or two there today that you're sort of scratching your head over. And certainly the penalty, I, th- I feel, would be one of those as it stands. You know, I'd like to look at it again and see. And um, but I felt at the time it was a little bit a little bit soft. But there we are. We've we've gathered ourselves in again at half time and come out with a bit more purpose and quality in the second half. And um, certainly deserve something out of the game. And you must be pleased to show that character to go behind away from home and yet fight back. Yeah, it's not easy. I think, as I say, second half, we've had more of the ball and used it more in a way that you know, we would expect to. Um, but having said that, you know, Darlington's had one or two moments there with a header and a shot across goal where you know, they could potentially have taken the game away from us. But um, as I said to the boys, you know, they've kept going and kept grinding on and delighted for Sim to come on and find himself in that position and finish in the way that he did was, you know, again, credit to the lad. He's, he's had a bad injury this season and not had many minutes with us, but, um, he's, you know, certainly done himself no harm uh, with, with what he, you know, came on and did today. Yeah, and it was a good goal. Matt, Matt Lowe driving run and then Simeon May finishing well, that yeah. critical, critical yeah, equaliser. It's a, you know, it's a fantastic strike, um, you know, to find himself in that moment and Matthew doing more of what we expect him to do and uh, yeah, it's important that, that he is you know, challenging people and travelling with the ball and getting into those moments and, and creating havoc in those situations and uh, like I say I think we, we picked up a bit in the second half but albeit we've had you know, some, some good moments in the opening period of the game that you would you know, on another day hope to do a little bit better. Now, two more big games coming up Tuesday. Boston coming to St James Park. Hopefully, we can get that game on. And then Blythe Spartans next Saturday. Yeah, again, tough games. Um, we've, you know, we've played at Boston. And unfortunately, came out on the wrong end of the, of the result. Um, but we were excellent on the night. And if we can play to that level again, then you know, we, there's, there's no two ways that we couldn't play to that level again and, and, and not win that game. But it's a different game and obviously we're at home and they'll be aware of that. And, um, you know, you take nothing for granted and realise you've got to go and do it all again. Uh, but certainly to get back to, you know, get back, get back home and, and, you know, hopefully uh, gather ourselves again after today. And, and if we can put in a, put, you know, one of the performances that we're capable of, we'll, we'll ask questions of Boston. And finally, the news on Glenn Walker after his injury last weekend. Yeah, he's, he broke his nose, obviously. Um, I think that's settling down and we'll see and assess Glenn prior to prior to Tuesday and see if he can take any part obviously as a as, a, as we said been a big big player and will continue to be a big big player for us so hopefully you know Glenn's able to to participate in some in some way on Tuesday okay well done today thank you